Today's episode covers CVE 2024 28956 an information disclosure vulnerability in multiple Intel processors. Published on May 13th, 2025, this flaw allows an authenticated local user to exploit shared microarchitectural structures during transient execution to leak sensitive data. While no public exploit exists, Intel and SUSE recommend applying microcode updates immediately. CVE 2024-28956 affects a range of Intel processors. Exact models are listed in Intel's official references. The issue is addressed by updated CPU microcode provided by Intel and packaged in SUSE's microcode Tonic CTL utility. System administrators running SUSE Linux should install the latest U-code Intel package to mitigate the risk. This is an information disclosure vulnerability arising from exposure of sensitive information in shared microarchitectural structures during transient execution. In plain terms, it's a Spectre class side channel flaw where speculative or out of order CPU operations can leak data across trust boundaries. An attacker with valid local credentials can trigger transient execution paths that leave remnant state in caches or other CPU buffers. By carefully measuring timing differences, the attacker can reconstruct sensitive information belonging to other processes or kernel memory. No remote attack vector exists. Physical or remote console access with user privileges is required. Intel's microcode update and SUSE's microcode hark CTCLA patch close the speculative execution window and prevent data leakage. CVE 2024 28956 reinforces the need for timely microcode and OS patches to defend against speculative execution side channel attacks. Although there's no known exploit in the wild, administrators should apply Intel's latest microcode and update SUSE's U-code Intel package immediately. Stay vigilant and subscribe for updates on emerging processor vulnerabilities and mitigation best practices.